Thanks for tuning in to the Barbara Cox Show. It's the Barbara Cox Podcast. And this is part two of who are you glorifying? Who are you glorifying today? As I sit and I think about everything that's happening in our world. And I think about my assignments that God has given me. If you know anything about me, then you know that there are several, several gifts that God has bestowed upon me there are several talents that God has poured into me and my desire is for those talents those gifts to be used for God's glory my passion is to uh, do everything that God has ordained for my life everything that he has ordered for my life everything that he has predestined for my life my desire is to do it it's not to be a person that that's um stable uh that that's unstable it's not to be a person that's not um strong minded when it comes down to the gifts that he's given me it's not to be a person that's easily uh discouraged by uh by people that talk against what it is that God has placed in my life to do my desire is to hear God's voice clearly and as I hear his voice to follow the direction of his voice um, and to follow the instructions that he's given me throughout the day. That's my desire because my desire is to do what God has given me to do on this earth during my appointed time all for his glory. I take no glory in what God does in my life. I take no glory in it, and meaning I do not use it for my self gratification. I give him glory to God be the glory for the things that he has done in my life to God be the glory for the things that he has done in, in people's lives that, that I know that have struggled and through their struggles, through their trials and tribulations, God gave them mercy. God gave them, gave them grace to God be the glory for the things that he's doing in our lives to God be the glory for every step that we take and everything that we do we do it through him through his strength to God be the glory so today's question who are you glorifying I can take nothing for this journey I can't take self gratification for this journey that I have that I have have sustained. It was because God's grace and God's mercy that follows me. It's because of God's angelic angels that go before me. It's because of God's anointing that breaks the yokes. It's nothing that I've done to deserve any of this. And it's nothing that I've done to receive the glory. All the glory goes to God. To God be the glory. To God be the glory. To God be the glory. But today, who are you giving glory to? Who are you glorifying? Yourself. Yourself. Are you glorifying yourself? Or are you glorifying God? Because God is the one that's giving you everything that you have. God is the one that has opened these doors that no man can open. Only God and no man can close. Only God has the ability, has given you the ability to walk through the door. Only God has even indicated to you that there's a door there. It's God that says, here is the door. Enter through the door that he has opened. God is the way. He is the light. And we can't even enter in until we go through Jesus Christ. So we've got to seek after Jesus. We got to call on the name of Jesus. Because when we call on the name of Jesus, things begin to happen. 
things begin to occur in the earth realm. There's a shifting in the atmosphere when we call on the name of Jesus. So today we must give all glory to the one, the great I am, the rock of ages, Jehovah Shalom, Jehovah Rapha. <laughs> we must give glory to him. The glory is due to him, not to ourselves. We must not think that we are so much greater than the next person. We are all filthy rags. We are all traveling down the narrow path. And it's the narrow path. If you're on the wide path, then you're on the wrong one. It's the narrow path. We're all trying to get through those golden gates. The gates of heaven. And we can't do that without seeking after God. We can't do that without laying at the feet of Jesus. We can't do that unless we're covered under the wings of the almighty. The almighty God. The king of kings, the Lord of lords, the prince of peace. So today, who are you glorifying? Who are you glorifying? Who are you glorifying today? Who are you glorifying today? Are you glorifying yourself? Well, I come today today to make a declaration today that you need not glorify yourself but God you need to seek after Jesus and not glorify yourself because once again it's not by your might it's not by your power but it's by the spirit of the Lord so to God be the glory for the things that he has done. And today all glory is due to God. We are made to worship him. We are made to praise him. So today lift your hands and surrender to God. If you have not done so, lift your hands and surrender to God. Give God all the glory that is due. Give him all the glory that is due, that is due to him. Not to you, not to me, not to the worldly possessions, but to God. To God be the glory for the things he has done. To God be the glory for the things that he has done. He has done so much for us. We cannot thank him enough. There are never enough words in the dictionary that can compare to anything that gives him praise and glory. There's not enough money in the world there's not enough gold there's not enough silver to compare to what God has done. So we can't take the glory because the glory belongs to the Lord. We take we can't take any credit because credit goes to the Lord. 
our God, our Savior. To the Lamb. To the light of the world. So today, who are you glorifying? Who are you glorifying? God has been so amazing to us. He has done so much. He's a good God. He's an almighty God. He's a great God. He's a God of omnipotent. We could not do anything without him. He sent his son for us. That we may have life and have it abundantly. And he came that we may have life. Eternal life. We didn't do that. We didn't speak light when there was darkness. We didn't speak to the water to to form the lakes and the streams and the oceans. We didn't blow breath into men. We didn't create all the animals. We didn't hang all the stars and the moon and the sun and told the moon when to come up and when the sun to shine. We did not do that. We did not wake ourselves up this morning. The alarm clock didn't wake us up. We did not put one foot in front of the other and begin to walk. We did not allow the voice to come out of our mouth and begin to talk. We did not do that. We did not allow us to have a job to receive an income so we can pay for our mortgages, pay for our rent, pay for our cars, pay for us to go into the grocery store and have food, give man the wisdom and the knowledge and the understanding to create things by hand, man-made. We did not do that. We are not our creator. We did not create ourselves. And we did not create the things that are in our lives that we are able to function, to operate daily. We did not do that. I didn't do that. You didn't do that. But God did. And he saw fit to save us by sending us his son. And he sent us mercy. He became the mercy seat. When he ripped the veil that kept us from him. He allowed Jesus to die on the cross. To be crucified and die on the cross. But he rose. God brought him. The resurrection. He resurrected his body from the dead. God did that. For us. So whose glory are you giving? Whose glory are you giving unto? Who who, who are you sending the glory to? Yourself or to God? To God be the glory. To God be the glory. To God be the glory. Hallelujah, Jesus. Who are you glorifying today? Who are you glorifying today? Who are you glorifying? To God be the glory. To God be the glory, to God be the glory for the things he has done. And oh, how can I say thanks for the things you have done for me? 
things so undeserved yeah you gave to prove your love for me the voices of a million angels cannot express my gratitude for all that I am and ever hope to be. I will all to thee. Oh, I owe it all to thee. Oh, I owe it all to thee. Oh, to God, to God, to God be the glory. Oh, hallelujah, Jesus, glory to your name. Hallelujah, Jesus, glory to your name. Hallelujah, Jesus, glory to your name, God. Thank you, Lord Jesus. Thank you, God. I give you glory. I give you praise. I give all the glory that's due to you, Lord God. I thank you. I thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Lord, I don't take the glory for myself. But I give the glory to you, to you, because to you, only through you can I do anything. Thank you, Lord Jesus. Thank you, Father. I can do all things through you as you strengthen me. I can't do it by myself. I need you, Lord Jesus. I need your help, Lord God. Hallelujah. Forgive us, Lord God, for trying to take your glory. Forgive us, Lord God, for trying to take your glory. Lord God, hallelujah, Jesus. I give you all the glory. I give you all the praise. I honor you, Lord Jesus. I worship you, Father, Lord God. Hallelujah, Jesus. To God be all the glory. I give you all the glory, Lord God. Hallelujah, Jesus. I thank you, Lord God. I thank you for your anointing, Father, Lord God. I pray right now in the name of Jesus. I pray right now in the name of Jesus that somebody out there, Lord God, anoint them from the crown of their head to the sole of their feet, that they no longer take your glory, Father, Lord God, but they give it to you, God. They no longer live their lives glorifying themselves but they begin to give you the glory they begin to give you the honor they begin to give you the praise they begin to worship you father lord god is my prayer lord god hallelujah jesus go right now to the earth rim lord god hallelujah jesus i speak right now a shift in the earth realm i speak a shift in the uh, 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 earth realm i speak a shift in the uh, 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 earth realm lord jesus right now in the name of jesus we give you glory lord god forgive us father lord god forgive us lord god for trying to take hallelujah your glory forgive us for trying to take your glory forgive us for trying to take your glory lord jesus glory hallelujah the glory belongs to you father hallelujah thank you jesus Thank you, God. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, God. We can't take your glory. Oh, hallelujah. I'm so full, Lord God. I'm so full. I'm full. I'm full, God. Hallelujah. You have fed me this morning, God. You have quenched my thirst, Lord Jesus. Hallelujah, Jesus. Because we can't take your glory. Oh, we can't take your glory. <laughs> Forgive us, Father. Forgive us, God. 
We can't take your glory, God. We give you all the glory. We give you all the praise. Oh, Lord Jesus. Oh, God, I can't finish this podcast. God, I'm too full. Oh, God, I can't finish it. God, I can't speak. Lord, I can't speak, Lord God. Oh, Jesus. Oh, thank you, God. (laughs) Oh, God. (laughs) Oh, God. (laughs) Give me strength, God. Give me strength, God. I'm praying for somebody out there. Holy Spirit, move through me. Holy Spirit, take over. Hallelujah, Jesus. Holy Spirit. Oh, Lord Jesus. Oh, we give you glory. Oh, we give you glory. Oh, we give you glory. We give you glory, God. We give you glory, God. We give you glory, God. 